This is the story of Sad Sack, the Type 2 error. Sad Sack lives in an island country called Interesting Land, where interesting things are happening all the time. Only poor Sad Sack never sees anything interesting. He misses it all. In Interesting Land, people are always making interesting discoveries. I've discovered how to make my vegetables grow faster. I've discovered how to keep giant snakes away. I've discovered how to teach my cow to ride a skateboard. But poor Sad Sack. Interesting things all around him, but he can't seem to discover anything at all. People don't really like being around Sad Sack. He's just so boring. Poor Sad Sack, the type two error. Nobody really likes a type two error. Now don't get me wrong, nobody really likes a type one error either, but they never ever happened in interesting land. Next to the country of interesting land is the neighboring island country of boring land where nothing interesting ever happens. In boring land, everything is pretty much the same all the time. All foods taste the same. The newspaper reports on all the non-news. Boring land is pretty boring. But in boring land, there is one person who forever thinks she's discovered something interesting. I've discovered a liquid that will make me fly. Her real name is Wanda, but everyone calls her Chicken Little because her discoveries are always false alarms. This new fuel additive will make your car get 100 miles per gallon. That's Chicken Little, the type one error. Always thinking she's discovered something interesting and it never ever pans out. Because in Boring Land, there is really nothing to be discovered. In Boring Land, it's considered rude to greet someone by saying, what's up? As if something interesting might happen. Instead, people greet one another by saying, ho hum. Ho hum, ho hum, ho hum. In fact, this greeting is so deeply rooted in the traditions of Boring Land that the country's official name is actually the People's Republic of Ho-Hum. On maps, it's usually abbreviated as H-O. Over in Interesting Land, discoveries are happening so much that people actually greet one another by saying, Aha! 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 Long ago, the people of Interesting Land changed their official name to the People's Republic of Aha. On maps, this is usually abbreviated as H-A. But of course, poor Sad Sack never makes any real discoveries. Poor Sad Sack, the type two error. Uh-huh. Now you know who Sad Sack and Chicken Little are, but they're not the only two characters in this story. Sad Sack actually has an identical twin brother, and they were accidentally separated at birth. And Sad Sack's twin is none other than the president of Boring Land. <laughs> The president of Boring Land presides over all the uninteresting, boring, non-events that happen every day in Boring Land. There's really so little of interest in Boring Land that the president only has one real job. He has to keep Chicken Little from driving everyone crazy. Chicken Little is always thinking she's discovered something interesting, but it's always a false alarm. The people of Boring Land really don't like all that commotion, so they tasked the president with keeping Chicken Little from getting all out of control. He told her that if she wanted to petition the government with a claim that she's discovered something interesting, she could present her evidence, but she was only allowed one petition every three weeks. The president of Boring Land always follows up on Chicken Little's petitions, putting his own researchers to work to see if they can replicate her discoveries. They never can. It's always the same story. Chicken Little, the false alarm, the type one error. There is one more character in this tale. Turns out that Chicken Little also has an identical twin. She and her twin were also separated at birth. And Chicken Little's twin is none other than Power Princess. Power Princess is everyone's hero in Interesting Land. In Interesting Land, where everyone is always making 
Interesting discoveries. Power Princess discovers more interesting things than anyone. If there's something interesting to be discovered, she'll find it. She's everyone's hero in interesting land. Power Princess is even Sad Sack's hero. He wants to be like her. I love you, Power Princess. Do you wonder how we found out about Sad Sack and all these other people? About a hundred years ago, a couple of sailors from our country got caught in an ocean current and found themselves on the shores of interesting land. Or maybe it was a fisherman. The history isn't entirely clear. These men met Power Princess and poor Sad Sack and also Chicken Little and the president of Boring Land. And they became friends. Before they left, Power Princess encouraged the men to stay in touch. And if they ever wanted to find out anything interesting, they should just call her and she would check it out. Not to be outdone, the president of Boring Land also assured them that if they ever wanted to find out anything uninteresting, then he would be happy to check that out for them. When they got back home, the men found that Power Princess and the president of Boring Land were true to their word. The men would send a question by message in a bottle to the islands, and back would come an answer from either Power Princess or the president of Boring Land. Later, the bottle became a balloon, then a telephone. And today, they chat with people of interesting land and boring land by video phone. Power Princess has made lots of interesting discoveries this way and shared them with the people of our world. And the president of Boring Land has also made lots of uninteresting non-discoveries and shared them with the people of our world. Every so often a message will appear to come from Power Princess, but it's really from Chicken Little. And every so often a message will appear to come from the president of Boring Land, but it's really from Sad Sack. But since Chicken Little is only allowed to claim a discovery of something interesting once every three weeks, most of the people in our country are willing to live with the occasional case of mistaken identity. And that's the story of Sad Sack. Poor, poor Sad Sack, the Type 2 error. He didn't even get the dignity of being called a Type 1 error. <laughs>